Hey everybody, I don't like making stories like this where teenagers are involved, children. I don't like making stories about mass shootings. But going back to the teenager comment, parents, you need to start raising your kids right. I know it's hard. You want to be your son or daughter's best friend. But your one job in life is to raise your kids to be responsible adults. This is the second story that I did just in a matter of like four hours involving teenagers. The first one was in Chicago. That's still an ongoing story. I did that video about three or four hours ago. And then this story. I didn't even come into my studio all day. Well, I came in to grab my phone charger. That was it. I sat down and watched movies. I had a nice day. Sitting down, watching a couple of great classic movies, Days of Thunder and Twister. And then I come in here and the world smacks me upside the head about how shitty this world is. <sighs> so let's get on with this article because this is like breaking news because you can see up here there's a channel live right now talking about it. And this ain't in some liberal town or liberal state damn Alabama really I guess people just can't deal with life anymore they can't deal with somebody being popular and them not as popular or you know somebody Stealing someone's boyfriend or girlfriend or, you know, a whole amount of stuff. In the last story, the more that I dug into it, there were kids out there with Bluetooth radios playing music, trying to film videos to go viral. It was called a teenager takeover. Parents, you have one job in life. And that is to raise your kids to be responsible adults. And if you can't do that, then kindly hand your children over to somebody else that can. I raised two kids that weren't even my own into being responsible adults. Which, in return, granted me four beautiful granddaughters. None of my kids have a criminal record. They're both responsible adults. Even though our lives, when they were growing up, was not easy. It was not easy whatsoever. I mean, hell, my late wife, my kid's mom, died when my daughter was just starting school as a junior. Yeah, imagine that. But, uh, and I haven't read through this, uh, this, uh, stuff yet. So, and you can tell I am dead tired. It is past midnight here in Phoenix, but it, it just never ends. Dade Bill shooting in a shocking incident, multiple children, were shot at a teenager's birthday party, Dadeville, Alabama, on Saturday. Yeah, this story is from India TV. It's the first one that popped up. The incident happened at around 10.30 p.m. on Saturday when officials were called for a shooting at a teenager's birthday party in the area of East Green Street and North Broad Knack Street in Dadeville, a small city in 
Tallapoosa County. There are no word from officials on the exact number of victims, but a graphic photo shared by a witness shows at least six people on the ground. All right, people. That right there just made me really... I could feel my blood pressure raising up. And how I could feel that is because the top of my head gets hot. As a parent, a parent that's on social media all the time, they get emails 24-7 from people like, hey, have you seen this? Hey, have you seen that? So many that I had to uh, stop responding to the Broken Patriot Videos emails and start up a new one. And if that one turns out like Broken Patriot Videos did, then uh, only a select few will know my email address. Because I can't handle this. I can't. But as a parent, oh my God. I would lose my shit if I got sent a picture of one of my kids laying dead. Think about that when you run up there to snap a photo of dead people laying on the ground. And this goes out to everybody that moderates social media. If a picture like that pops up, you not only need to take that picture down, you need to ban that individual. And I mean ban them. Ban their IP address. So they will know next time that, hey, you know, showing dead bodies, you know, no, that's just wrong. And then the story goes on down here. Two killed in Louisville. Yeah, mass shootings in the U.S. surged in the past few years. Why? Answer me that. Why? And don't say, well, look how the country's going. Inflation. Yeah, stop it with that, you know, blame game. You want to know why there's mass shootings all over the place? Because people are mentally fucked up. Because their parents raised them mentally fucked up. Because their their parents are mentally fucked up. I don't know what to say anymore. And on that note, this video's done.